hey, hey, and welcome to Brooklyn's Barbie Bay. I am so excited because another um, Amazon package came yesterday, and guess what it was? It was our extra fly dolls, and it looks like we have the desert doll, and we also have, you know, maybe she's going to Colorado or our snow doll, so I'm super excited to um, show you guys these these girls out of the box so let's get started without further ado I hate to just be talking 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 and then we don't have enough time to really dissect and go through these dolls so which one am I gonna start with I'm in love in love with this doll in her outfit so let's start with her okay so first up we have the Barbie extra fly and it, this looks like the um, I don't, it doesn't say like her travel, okay, seems to be going to somewhere that's super cold, but she is definitely going to be stylish going there. Um, the package, I love the fact that it is made like a um, suitcase, like a roller suitcase, which is something that she does come with. Um, she's got her extra fly tags on here. The bottom of it has like, you know, wheels, pretend wheels, and the top is like, you know, your, your part that you, the handle on the side. Um, it has a couple of stickers that just say extra fly on them. And then um, on the back of the box, you see the doll. Um, it looks, it says 15 pieces. Um, she's got a passport day. She's got her friends here, everyone together. And then her and the um, desert Barbie doll that I'm going to unbox in a few seconds. Well, not a few seconds, a few minutes. Um, is on here as well. So it looks amazing. I hope it does not disappoint when I take her out of the box. Listen, I'm going to tell you all now, I'm going to redress this doll in another doll. Cause I, is all, are those gloves? Does she have on gloves? Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's get her out of the box. Okay. So here we have our Barbie out of the box and I'm going to first show you what she comes with. Um, this, as I showed you in my last video, she came, comes with this extra fly. It says five o'clock and it's like her boarding path. It kind of looks like she comes with um, a little small boarding pass for Barbie and a little passport, as you can see, a little passport and ticket. She comes with a purple purse that is in the shape of a snowflake. Um, I don't know if you could, yeah, I guess you could bend it. You can get like something kind of small in there, like maybe her ticket. Let's see, we'll put her passport in her purse. And it's kind of like, you know, see through a little bit and we'll put her ticket in her purse so we don't lose it. Then she comes with this really cute, which I love, this um, suitcase. Um, the, the handles does not do not go down, um, but it has this Barbie Extra Fly like um, suitcase ticket on it. Um, and it does open. Okay, so you can put a couple of things in there if you like. Right, let's see. Can her purse fit in there? Oh, absolutely. I'm, I'm always about you know, keeping stuff together. So she's got her purse. Now, um, I wish they would have made the handle a little bit bigger or able to move because technically like it doesn't, it doesn't roll. Well, this does roll. Okay. So this, this does roll. So you can roll the suitcase, right? But when you put it next to Barbie, it's not like her hand, you know, it's not proportionate to her hand, but that's okay. Let's take her. This is my doll stand. She does not come with a doll stand. Um, but let's get into her in her outfit. She comes with these really cool glasses as well. Very cute. I love it. Um, and then we have, she's got her earmuffs on. Her hair is blonde and pink. She's not my favorite Barbie face sculpt. Okay. Um, for the one of the blonde dolls. I think they could have did better with a different face scope. I don't know. She's just not giving to me. So, um, but I don't, I, I'll probably rebody or redo something. I'm not too sure. Um, she does, she is fully articulated. So she's got the wrists at the movement. You got the, um, at the elbow, um, at the shoulder. She, um, can definitely at the, she's not made to move, but she is articulated. Okay, she's got this really cute pink, um, excuse me, um, blue, and it's fuzzy with, um, what is that they, they put in it? Tinsel. So it's got like blue tinsel in it. Can you see that? I do not like her hair at all. This is that poly hair. Oh my God. Ah, oh, and her out the box, she's shedding as well. Okay, just to let you know. 
Um, I love the fact that she's got these um, pink gloves on. So super cute. And I am an obsessed and just loving her jumper itself. Let me see if I can take these little taggy things off because you know they, they clip them down. You got to be really careful when you do this, guys, so that you don't um, clip the clothing. So I'm just going to do this right here. Okay. So she's got a really cute, um, and the jumper that she has on is not like with sleeves. It's, it's a sleeveless jumper. It is pink as Barbie would do it and metallic pink. I mean, just glittery pink. I love the um, belt. It is a bear. And then you have, you know, like the plastic belt that goes along with this. So this is all attached just so you know. Um, and then you have a heart, another bear, um, another, I don't know what that is on that side, but you've got some accessories like pretend hanging, I call it. Um, and it just buckles on the back as one belt. And then she's got these snow boots on. I wish she would have had some really cute heels on, but you know, that's the whole beauty of being able to restyle your doll, right? Um, so I think this is really, really cute. I, I don't like the hair. I do not like the face sculpt. Um, and I'm trying to figure out, um, I just don't like her face sculpt. Tell me what you think. Like, are you obsessed with her face sculpt? Is she really pretty? The hair is just so horrible. It's just horrible. It's horrible. It's, it's shedding. I don't know. It's like you give us, for $24.99, you give us an amazing doll, okay? An amazing clothes. And I don't know if Barbie at this point is saying, you know what, we're going to give them the fashion and we'll skimp on a couple of things. Like, they won't, if we give them some really good fashion, they won't really notice what we're doing with other stuff. But we're collectors, and so we, we're going to notice what's happening with the dolls that we love. Um, She's also got these um, really cute bangles on. They're silver. Um, she's got a neck choker. I don't know if I showed that. That's silver. She's got a lot of stuff that's kind of like, um, um, uh, tied down to her as well. So I don't want to take so much off of her at this point because we still have another doll to review. Um, but it's a really cute set. Okay. So I'm definitely giving it an, an eight out of a 10 because I love the outfit. I love the accessories. I think they did a really great job. If the only complaint I have with this doll is going to be just her hair, um, that saran hair. It looks like so much better in the stock photos, but when you get it out of the box, this is what you're getting, you know? So play around with it, reroute if you want to. Her hair is um, blonde and pink, which I'm, I'm just loving that Barbie's coming back to that pink. You know, we haven't seen a whole lot, you know, with our girls with pink. So this doll really was, when I saw her, I was like, oh yes, I have to have her. But when you look at those photos, her hair looks so voluptuous and beautiful. And then when you take it out the box, right, okay. So she she's going to need a hot water boil. She's going to need a lot of work and tender love and care to her. Um, but I might just put her outfit on a different doll, which is what I'm always doing. Um, to be honest with you, I like to redress them, find something else for them to wear, see how they look um, with another doll. So definitely I want the clothes for this and that's primarily why I got it. So I'm not, you know, fussing about it, but I just think those of you that actually want this doll are going to be a tad bit um, disappointed with the hair, especially, and you might want to reroute. And I'm just not fond of her face sculpt, to be honest with you. She's not one of my favorite face sculpts. Like, let me show you. If she would have had this doll's face sculpt, ooh, ooh, maybe I can give me that outfit. Can you think, you think she can fit this outfit? Don't make me, don't make me have to re, don't make me redo this. Can I? Should I? I mean, I really think she would make a better, I, what do you think? Should I do it? Can I do it? Let's see. And here we go. So I like her better on this curvy doll um but let me be honest with you about this it i'm i'm holding the belt because it does not clasp all the way and as you can see you know you'll have a little peekaboo right there if you put it on a curvy made to move um doll body but i absolutely love it on her i just wanted to make sure it could kind of fit on our curvy girl i love this doll way better in this outfit i didn't put the gloves on because it took me way too long um, but I love it. 
I absolutely love it. She looks great. Tell me what you think, which doll that you feel like she looks better on. Um, I'm going to put this on another doll as well and play around with this outfit, but I absolutely love it. Okay, let's get to our next Barbie Extra Fly doll. Okay, so here we have our desert themed looks Barbie, like she's going to Arizona, or she looks like, you know what she looks like she's going to Coachella. Absolutely. I see some boarding passes and a couple other things. So as you can see, same setup on the back of the box, her and Barbie, her five friends, and it. Uh, oh my gosh, are those clear boots? This looks amazing. Let's get her out of the box and let's talk about her. Okay, so here she is out of the box. And let me tell you guys something. I love her so far the best. I love her face sculpt. I love everything. Let me just get into what she came with first. With this doll, um, I like the fact that not only did she come with um, her passport and uh, her little ticket, right? So she came with those. But she also came with a cell phone because, you know, at Coachella, you got to be able to call somebody. So she came with a little cell phone and she also came with her water bottle. I thought that was really cute accessories to give give her. Um, she's got her VIP pass on, as you can see. Um, I love this oversized purse. This, you know, this is what makes Barbie so extra and this line so extra. I, I love the fact that this doll is very, very cohesive. Um, I, I wish this could have had like real fringe on it. It's just like a huge piece of plastic, but I'm going to give them an A for effort because they, they tried to give us a little something. I love her heart shaped glasses. Let me bring her a little closer so you can see her beautiful face. Isn't she gorgeous? Her smile is pretty. Oh, she's gorgeous. Let's get into what she has on and put this to the side and take her off my doll, doll skin. Now this may be Polly here as well, but as you can see, it didn't shed coming out. It looks absolutely gorgeous. I don't know who styling who, you know, which person was doing which doll, but they absolutely nailed it with this particular doll. She's got on this fringe coat. Um, it has some plastic appliques on them. It looks like stickers on them. It, you know, I guess it's, um, but it's so, so Woodstock vibed. I love it. Um, and underneath it, I absolutely love her two piece. So she's got like a two piece short set on. It's rainbow colored. Okay. Um, and then she's got this amazing fringe on this jacket. I'm not, I'm not a fan of the fringe. Okay. But it gives me the whole Woodstock. I'm feeling it. Um, not going to take off any points because this is absolutely a 10 for 10, um, with this particular doll. I love her boots the best. Okay. They are translucent. You can see right through them and they're like a light pink. So cute. They absolutely nailed it with this doll. I am so obsessed. I love it. Um, and I can put her things in her purse. Uh-oh. Let me try to put it in there while I'm holding her. So I can put her water bottle in her purse. Can I? Yeah, I can. Just gotta, you just got to hold and put her down. See, you have that little opening where you can put stuff in. I can put her cell phone in there. I'm just going to put her passport in there now so I don't lose anything and her um, stuff and then I'm going to put her cell phone in her hand because she's going to call up the gang and let them know she's here for them to go ahead and, and meet her. Um, so yeah, I think this is absolutely amazing. I love it. I love it. I love her glasses, which are these heart shaped glasses. And let me bring her closer so you can see her pretty face. Isn't she gorgeous? I absolutely love her. I'm so glad that she's a part of um, my Dollyverse. I mean, she's absolutely beautiful. They hit it out the park with this doll. I'm glad because I was a little sad with the last one that we just unboxed, the snow one. Um, but I'm really loving this Desert Barbie and I cannot wait for her to be um, added to my collection. Well, she's here now, so she's going on the collection shelf because she's absolutely gorgeous. I don't want to take anything off of her. Um, but probably this coat. But she still is killing it. Excellent job. 10 out of 10. I love it. Um, let me know what you think um, about both dolls. Let me know which one you like the best. Was it the Desert Barbie or was it the Snow um, Extra Barbie, Extra Fly Barbie? I have three three other ones that are on the way. Well, two other ones that are on the way. Um, I have the two Beach, Beach Ken. I did find him. Thank you guys for the comments on where to get him. And then, um, which is Amazon, is where I got him. 
And then I have the other beach doll who, as soon as they come in, I'll be unboxing those together. Um, but thank you for this quick video, just an unboxing of our Barbie Fly Extra dolls. Thank you guys and have an amazing day. And oh, thank you for watching Brooklyn's Barbie Bay. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you have not already, and leave a positive comment down below. I love your um, critiques and I also love um, what you all have to say and I'm glad that you're enjoying this content. Have a great day.